But first, a developing story right now. Aurora police looking for a fake cop. They say he was driving an unmarked black car when he pulled over a woman along I-225 near I-70 in broad daylight. And 70s reporter Russell Haythorn is live. Russell, this guy looked pretty convincing. Yeah, you guys, the victim came here to the Aurora Police Department about an hour after she was pulled over because she started to suspect the guy who stopped her was not a real cop. This all happened in broad daylight on Sunday afternoon on southbound I-225, just south of I-70. The victim was pulled over by a dark-colored Dodge Challenger with no markings, but it did have red and blue flashing lights in the front window. The victim was asked for her license which she gave to the suspect and was eventually told to get out of the car while the suspect searched the vehicle. Only after the search did the female victim realize she had been robbed, her wallet, and an electronic device missing. She didn't notice that he had any uh, visible markings from a police department. It was a dark colored uniform, but it did not have a badge or a patch or anything that would signify any of the police departments in the metro area. During the traffic stop, she did feel that something was off. This guy did apparently have a holster with a handgun and handcuffs. The victim also says there was a second suspect in the vehicle who never got out of the car during the stop. If you have any information about this, call Aurora Police. Live in Aurora, Russell Haythorn, 7 News.